even though we've been so good about talking in these sessions, I still find that I'm like, well, I really want to talk about this. Well, when are we have meeting with Jamie next? Well, it becomes fun. I feel I don't want I wouldn't say fun. Well, I mean, it feels there are good. Be good, yes. I mean, I wasn't laughing in those sessions. My point is, I don't know if that's the right adjective. I think it's been feels good. Sure. In my, I mean. Love that adjective. I'm good with that. <laughs> We've gone through a tough few months, tough year, whatever you want to call it, right? Um, having a session with him helps me be more in tune with myself. I hope, I think, and I hope it helps you kind of reflect. Well, that's what I mean by being in tune, right? Yes, reflection. Mm. I'll let you finish that by your problems here. All I'm saying is that this is helping us. I think we're in a way better place, way better place. Um, you know, and we've been married for 27 years. We've never had so much going on in our lives. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. become um, hard, <laughs> right? It's become really hard. Well, I'm not someone who's gonna, you know, while you're at work, stay home and go shopping. Like, or, Nor do or, I want or, you, you to. Know. Your career is amazing. You've got all these amazing creative ideas about shows and all these things. And, and I've grown a lot. I have 85 offices. I'm gonna have 100 offices by the end of this year, right? Like, I mean, it's, uh, I'm opening up two offices a month. I mean, it's crazy stuff. You know, we're both growing. We're both changing. We're about to be empty nesters. We've hit our 50s. We're not <laughs> empty nesters yet, though. You keep saying that. I know, so. honey, but from your perspective, you're looking at today, and today you're correct. I'm looking at, you know, what tomorrow is gonna look like, and tomorrow is gonna be here very fast. But the point is, for me, yes, I'm thinking of that, but I'm also, th we have to think about today. I sometimes just get frustrated that I don't feel like I'm being heard. I want to be in a place in my life that I feel happy and fulfilled. I'm not going to stay in a situation that, that I'm not happy in. And things that I wouldn't want my daughters to accept, I'm not going to accept for myself. I feel like I've learned a lot from you. You have taught me that I need to parent you and Jade differently because you have different needs. And that was a big learning curve for me. Yeah. I know you're 15, you're gonna learn how to drive soon and all that stuff scares me, honestly. And, but it's part of parenting and it's part of letting you go. And uh, I know you've been asking for some freedom. Mm -hmm. And so I think, you know, you taking an Uber to meet your friends or go hang out is, um... Is fine? It's fine. Great, thank you, Mom. <laughs> They're becoming, you know, more independent of me and it's making me realize that now I need to put myself first because they're gonna be gone and I'm left with me. Obviously, I can track the car, but I want you to text me when you get there. Does that sound good? Yes. Are you happy it. about that? Yes. It may not be perfect all the time, mm -hmm. but... Um, You'll try to get better? Well, I wouldn't say that I'm not good. <laughs> I guess I'll see it as a sign of symbolism for better things to come.